With the Embed 2.0, we're shipping a lot of improvements to WIST. These improvements will help make the platform more robust, more scalable, and easier to use. Most importantly, your apps from now on will be even faster. All right, with that out of the way, let's have a look at the new WIST configurator. The first thing you'll notice is that we no longer have data in and data out requests. All of our requests from now on live within the requests panel. This way, everything is going to be much easier to find. All your get, post, put, and delete requests will live here from now on. Next, you'll notice that we no longer have the auth panel. The auth panel was responsible for two main functions. We had pre-built requests here at the bottom, and we were setting up access control rules. But if you think about access control rules, it's essentially an action that happens when the page is loaded. We are checking if the attribute is present, and then we're running some logic, and we're deciding whether we want to redirect the user to a fallback page, or we want to let the user stay on the current page. So in the new configurator, access control rules live within the actions panel. Also, we no longer use pre-built requests. These requests took only a few seconds to build yourself, and most users weren't really using it. Next, we also made changes to the page data panel. General settings are now at the top, so that it's easy to find variables, navigation data, cookies, input fields, and the new form fields, which we'll cover in another video. All of your requests are located right below the general settings. The last thing that you'll notice in the configurator is that we now support nested folders. You can have actions within folders and you can have folders within folders and actions within the nested folders. And that's a quick overview of the new WIST configurator. Within the upcoming videos, we'll dive deeper into the functionalities that are coming with the new version. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.